What's going on Zwifters? So in this video I am going to tell you why you gotta hop on over into the climb portal. I was not a fan or wasn't interested at first uh, and then I tried it and uh, hey you, you gotta hop on over there so stay tuned I'll tell you all about it. Here we go. All right, let me walk through the process on how I jumped on over to the Zwift Climb portal. So we'll start with, hey, what motivates me to use Zwift? Uh, one, it takes my fitness score, you know, watts, etc., pushes it over into Training Peaks. Uh, two, it motivates me because you got to get all these badges and, and courses, and I want to do all, all of them. So. Uh, I have never really done a workout in Zwift and I haven't used the Zwift uh, climb portal and then I watched an update from uh, I call him the Dalai Lama guy the uh, guy from Australia who does the awesome uh, Zwift reviews and uh, bike reviews and it said hey they added a badge actually three badges for the Zwift climb portal so I'm like oh man now I gotta hop on over there to try to get the uh, those uh, three badges so one uh, if you climb it once uh, you get one badge and then uh, if you climb it 10 times you get a badge and if you climb it 25 times you get another badge so I was addicted I climbed Alp de Zwift uh, 25 times and I got that badge I think it's called misogynist um, so I jumped on over entered the climb uh, portal so you enter it just as you do hey you pick in any uh, normal uh, course that you do you scroll down through the apps and Zwift and uh, hit the climb portal I believe the course will change every so many days. Um, so I went on in. You start in your regular course in uh, Watopia and you go through a, a circle climb portal and you enter the climb portal. I haven't been a fan of the graphics. I've been looking on other uh, screens and, and ads and like, yeah, it looks like a Nintendo game. My favorite Nintendo game is uh, Just Dance and it looks exactly like that. So I love those graphics for a Nintendo game, but doesn't necessarily excite me to uh, do a Zwift ride uh, th through there, so that's what that's what was no reason why it was holding me back uh, from uh, going through there. So I start going through uh, up through the climb portal, and it is pretty. It's just like Alp to Zwift, where there's segments. There's actually nine in the the current course that they have as I'm recording this. Nine segments, anywhere from like two minutes to four minutes long, and uh, it, it tracks how long it takes you to get through that segment and how you're doing uh, for your personal best uh, going through that segment. Um, then I noticed, hey, every time you hit that segment, the the wheel spins and you get a random uh, points or, or level ups. And man, I went up out to Zwift the first time. I swear I got uh, 250 points at least four times. So I'm like, dang, I was I was leveling up. I'm basically going from like level 37 to level 38 in Zwift in uh, basically a week. So I've gone up this thing like six times this week already. Uh, I say the downside is it's so easy to level up because you get these 250 points all the time that, uh, hey, I don't want to beat the game that quick because that's what motivates me to keep on riding through Zwift uh, is the challenge to keep on trying to get through all the levels and the badges. So, um, and, and one aspect, hey, it's getting so easy to level up. So, hey, I'm telling you, this is the fast, the new fastest way to level up in Zwift is to go through the Zwift climb portal. So it's just like climbing out to Zwift and you get the wheel at the top and you get uh, random points, 250,000 every time. So uh, I tried it again shooting this video for you and three different times out of those nine, uh, the wheel spun and I got 250 points uh, each time. So it's just so easy to level up. So uh, I'm kind of addicted. Uh, just the last four days in a row I've, I've uh, gone up it, I actually went up it twice this morning as well just educating myself so I could do this video for you now so once you get to the top uh, it's to tell you your time you go around through a circle then you could uh, you can't you could coast back down but there is some uh, undulating so you can't it's not like you just can't pedal and get the whole way to the bottom you have to pedal a little bit and then you could go back down and outside and it'll take you outside of the portal back into Watopia. So I did try this morning. Once you get back out, you could turn around and it counts again. You could go back up to the top and it counts again towards those 
uh, amount of times you climb it to get those badges. So, hey, I'm recommending it. You got to jump on over. So literally, it took 24 minutes, uh, 22 minutes this morning to climb uh, th this uh, climb portal and you're getting thousands of uh, points. So you're going to get all your other points every... I, I use the uh, English, so I'm getting 30 points for every mile you go. So I'm getting those points on top of all these 250 points that keep on popping up. So you got to switch on over. All right, there you have it. I like to keep my videos short and sweet and to the point. Uh, if you like the video, please hit the like button for me. Subscribe if you want to come back. Every time I find uh, something new out, I post a video on it, uh, whether it be a, an extra credit badge or another badge or an update like that. So, uh, all right, hope you enjoyed it. Have a good one. Get out there or get down in your basement and uh, ride your bike on Zwift. So, have a good one.